The main purpose of the digital drum is to have the content developed uh, appropriately for the local community. The idea is uh, an educational system for uh, young children, youth. In a typical African village, their world is as big as they can walk. They've got no idea about America, they've got no idea about the rest of the world. It's, it's a very small community. Now all of a sudden you come along and you expose them to all this new knowledge. On the conventional installations it has uh, Wikipedia and then Gutenberg Library, like a selection of Gutenberg Library. Educational materials from K through 12 and then higher education videos and, and curriculum. What we typically find is that you get one or two people using the keyboard and about 10 or 15 people standing around shouting instructions. So when somebody on the gets it right on the keyboard, the entire group learns as opposed to you know, sitting in a classroom watching somebody else do the work. Over the course of a day, the kids' math skills improve. Like, it's, it's remarkable. And it's also a lot of fun. The goal is to install this model or something similar in the different communities throughout Uganda. Uganda is in a particular situation where none of the higher-end manufacturing is available. So basically we're trying to answer the question of how do you create a similar device using locally available materials and uh, skill sets. Very often the computers are locked up or are not functioning. So it's one of the reasons why we make it uh, weatherproof so we can install it pretty much on the street so anybody can, uh, can access it. It makes a huge difference. It's that sense of empowerment. Uh, suddenly I can access knowledge that I've never been able to access before.